how to create the shake effect in After Effects. Okay, so we wanna add some shakes to our music video. First off, we wanna drag our footage into a new composition, like so. We want to go to Effects and Presets, and we wanna search for Wiggle. And Wiggle Position. And all we need to do is just drag and drop that onto our footage, like so. And it'll bring up the effects control panels here on the left. But first, we wanna find the points of where we wanna put the camera shakes. So let's just scrub through the footage to find an impact. And our first impact is there. So as you can see, she raises a foot, boom, we want it to impact there. So at this point, we're gonna to go to the drop down menu here and click on to effects. And this is the wiggle position. So we wanna drop down here as well. So that's the point where we want it to start to wiggle. So we're gonna put it in a keyframe here. And then we're gonna zoom in a little bit and we're gonna go back probably three frames, like so. So this keyframe, we're gonna keep it at zero. This keyframe, we're gonna set it to 24 or 25. And the wiggle amount, we're gonna keep it at around 45. And then we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five and then turn the wiggle position off here, like so. So that is our first impact shot. So when we play it back, boom. That's our first camera shake. Now I think I'm just gonna play around with the shake amount. So I'm just gonna bump it up to 57 and see what that looks like. Boom, okay. So the next one, we're gonna put one in, is there's a jump shot that comes up here. Boom. There, that's where we want the impact to come in. So again, we will press this little diamond shape here to create a keyframe. We're gonna zoom in. We're gonna go back one, two, three keyframes. Have another keyframe in position. So at the moment it's set to zero. When we go to our second keyframe, we wanna put that back up to around about 20 to 25. And then one, two, three, four, five, and that's where we want it to stop wiggling. Okay, so that was our second one. So when we play it back, we now have another camera shake impact there. Now we just need to tidy up the border slightly. So what we're gonna do here is just press S on the keypad to bring scale, and we're gonna scale it up to about, I'm gonna go up to 105%. So now that should tidy up the borders a hell of a lot better. That is how easy it is to put a camera shake into a dance routine.